Hey, what's up guys? Today I wanted to make a video talking about why journaling is so important. Um, journaling um, can mean many different things. Um, it could mean simply just writing down what your thoughts are. It could mean um, drawing pictures just whenever you feel like you need to kind of go off and be alone, especially if you're, you feel like you're more introverted, like I am for sure. Um, so you can just go off and kind of reflect and kind of take a look at yourself. And so these are my top reasons for why I choose to journal. And let me look in my journal to talk about why journaling is so awesome. Um, number one, it lets you get your thoughts out and express your feelings. Um, there's a lot of times for me that I am in a situation where I feel a certain emotion, but I don't know how to express it or I feel as if expressing it isn't the best thing to do, or I don't know how to express it in a way that would be um, constructive in the moment. And so journaling can just kind of be this outlet for you to splatter out all these thoughts and feelings that you have. And that can be very helpful just to kind of let this energy flow out of you. Um, another thing, is it helps you become more positive and able to see difficulties as challenges to overcome. Um, this is a big one for me. Um, I tend to look at every little thing that can go wrong and kind of make it seem like the sky is falling. Um, but whenever I take it to paper, um, usually I, I end up writing, you know, what's on my mind, what's, what's going on and what's what seems to be the difficult situation and by the time I get through it I almost always come to the realization or end up writing like positive affirmations like you know this like this too shall pass or everything happens for a reason um, this is just another obstacle this is a stepping stone um, for me to get to where I really need to go and so journaling and writing um, can really help you get to a point where you're, you are um, searching and learning from your mistakes rather than just ruminating on them and making them bigger than they actually are. Um, so another thing is it helps you reflect and become more self-aware. Um, basically when you write or whenever I write I seem to um, be able to take a look at myself, try to take a step back and observe myself and just try to try to be able to um, acknowledge how I've been feeling lately and what may be the cause and just doing that asking these asking those questions can help you um, can help you just be more in, in touch with your own body and your own feelings um, emotions and um, that can really help you be more self-aware and when you're more self-aware you can better relate to other people because you know what's going on in, in your own body and your own mind, um, which helps you see what's going on with others too. Um, the last thing I have written down is you can record progress and set goals. Um, this is an important one because you can, you can go back and see what you've written at previous times and um, you can see how far you've come in the matter of weeks, months, years and um, it's kind of it's definitely a possibility that you kind of get sidetracked or not sidetracked you kind of get sucked into the the past by reading some old stuff but if you can kind of if you can step back again and be in that objective mindset where you're just observing yourself and really taking note of how you felt and how how your emotions have changed as well as your thinking um, it's a really beneficial tool for you to employ and it's helped me a lot just to be able to take things to the paper with my pen and just reflect and set goals and really try to figure out what my life purpose is and really dig deep and try to overcome fears and try to realize what these fears are in the first place. Um, and yeah, so 
those are my reasons for why you should start journaling or why journaling is so fantastic. Um, I think everyone should at least do some form of these, do some form of journaling and, and other people who are better at being more self-aware and self-regulating without a journal, then that's kudos to you. But for me, um, being able to take it to pen and paper, um, being able to take what's going on in my mind to pen and paper um, has really helped me to be able to do many things that I didn't think I would be able to do. Um, so yeah, hope you guys learned a little bit. Have a good day. Peace.